Hey everyone, this is Larry. Welcome back to Today I Feel Like. I recently got a NVIDIA Shield Android TV player and I have to say this thing is pretty awesome. And I wanted to show you the first five apps that you should put on your Android TV box or Android TV player when you get a new one, like the NVIDIA Shield or the TiVo Stream 4K or your Fire Stick or whatever. So let's jump into it. I already have the apps on my device. So let's jump in, check them out and here we go. All right, so here we are on my NVIDIA Shield home screen, and let me show you the first five apps. And the first one is pretty obvious, but let's go to the app section, and the first one here is YouTube. Now, the reason why I say YouTube is the first one, and that is because, well, I want you to be able to watch this video and all kinds of other great videos on your big screen and the best way to do that is to be able to actually go ahead and have YouTube on your Nvidia Shield. Also, there's some great videos on YouTube that are in fairly low resolution like 480p and with the upscaling that the Nvidia Shield offers, you can have YouTube videos that would normally look pretty crappy look pretty great on your big screen. Also, while you're here, why don't you come over here to my channel and subscribe that would help a lot all right moving on let's go to number two now number two this one i think is a must for anybody who has an nvidia shield or any other android based tv and that is downloader this app is absolutely fantastic we'll go ahead and open that up right quick this app is going to give you a way to download apps from other places other than the uh, google or the google play store yes so Anyways, you can see here that you actually have a, a URL bar in there that you can add uh, full links in there to download stuff, or you can come here to the browser and you can actually browse to the internet and find where those links are. So if you want to download an app from a particular website, you just go to that website, click and download the app. And that is Downloader. And Downloader is actually available right here in the Google Play Store. You just simply come up here, go to search, and once you're on search, you just go over here and type in Downloader. And you'll see, as soon as I type in D, you'll see where it says Downloader by uh, AFTV News. Click that right there. And you'll see there it is. It's Downloader by AFTV News. It is a fantastic, fantastic app. And yeah, it's free. You can use it free. They work on donations only. So if you enjoy it, support the developers and donate a, you know, a cup of coffee or two to them so they can keep going. All right, that's number two. Let's move on to number three. Now, number three is fantastic, and this one is Aptoid TV. Now, Aptoid TV is an app that allows you to be able to download all kinds of great apps that uh, through their app store. It's an alternative app store, so you can download all kinds of great stuff through them. Some apps you can get that are available not in the Google Play Store, but you can still get the apps, for instance, like Puffin TV browser. It is a web browser designed for your TV. And the great thing about it is, is that there are apps that are available for uh, Google or for Android TV that aren't available in the Google Play Store. And you can get a lot of those apps here on Aptoid TV. Also, if you live in a place that tries to block your consumption, if you live in a place that tries to prevent you from watching certain news, you know, you can come here and you can get some of those apps that you want to watch. For instance, let's say that you are you want to be able to watch the BBC and you happen to be in Russia and they're blocking that out. You can come over here and you can go ahead and search for BBC and you'll see right there it's going to say BBC iPlayer. You can click that there and there it is right there. You have the BBC iPlayer and to get this, all you have to do is click on it and you'll see right there, you will have the option to download it. Now you'll notice that they will tell you if there's anything needed extra, like this one says it, it's going to need a mouse, but you can go ahead and download it if you like. And there may be other versions on here as well. So, and you may actually get a thing actually if you want to, uh, to record, if you want to use this so that you can use the voice remote on here. I'm gonna just go ahead and click deny. I don't, I don't want them to do that. But once you get on here, you can come here and you can see there's going to be other BBC iPlayer results on there as well that you can go ahead and download. It may work fine. It may not. And you can just come down here and try and check and find the ones that may work for you. Again, this one hasn't been tested for your device. So 
you just go ahead and find the one that works best for you. But that one is Aptoid TV. And to get this one, you're gonna to have to actually sideload it, which means you're gonna to need to go directly to the Aptoid TV website. Now, to get there, you can simply use Downloader and you can go to Downloader and you can type in, uh, you know, I think it's, think it's like tv.aptoid.com and then you can, get the, uh, you can get the download for that app right there. All right, that's number three. Let me show you number four. Now, number four is IP Vanish. That's right, IP Vanish. IP Vanish is a VPN. So if you are uh, if you are somewhere and you want to be you want your traffic to look like it's coming from somewhere else, or you want to mask your traffic, for instance, let's say that you want to uh, to have your traffic looking like it's coming from um, Uzbekistan or the Philippines so that you can read their newspapers and read their and watch their TV from there you can do that you just click where it says um, you can click the the little location icon right there and then you can select your country right here and you can either come in you can also select your various cities so you can come in here and find all kinds of different cities let's say you want to select uh, Buenos Aires you can do that or maybe you want it to look like you're coming from uh, from Dublin you can do that you know, maybe you want to go and if you want to use the BBC iPlayer, maybe you want to connect to Glasgow so that you can uh, you can access the BBC iPlayer. It's very very cool. It's uh, it's a fantastic app. These these are, are apps that people should have all over the world because it unlocks the amount of content that you can view and it, it really opens up the entire world to you so that you can see content from everywhere. Now this is not a free app. You do need a subscription for IP Vanish. So uh, I'll leave a link to it down in the video description. So if you want to try it out, you can try it out or get signed up and get a subscription if you like it. It is a fantastic service. This is the uh, this is one of the uh, the VPNs that I use personally. All right, that was number four. Let's go on to the last one, number five. And this one is a must, I believe. These are all must, but this one is fantastic. And this is mx player pro i love this app right here and the thing that's special about this app is that it allows you to play content media files directly from the micro sd card that you can put into your nvidia shield and it's going to go ahead and for instance i have a i have a micro sd card in there right now I can go ahead and play this video if I want. I click that. It's going to ask me if I want to. I was already watching it, so you can go ahead and click resume or start over. And I'll just hit resume. And we can see there it's going to start playing. And I can go ahead and just scrub on through. We can see how easy that works, how fantastic it looks just like that. And, yeah, this thing is absolutely amazing right there. So, yeah, that is, uh, that is MX Player Pro. And I think you really, really should have a media player like MX Player Pro. It just makes life so much easier. Now, you can get this from Aptoid TV if you wanted to. You can come in here and you can go up here and you can just type in MX Player Pro if you want to. You can type in MX Player and you'll see there's going to be MX Player Pro. You can click that and you can get the you can get the pro player if you want right there. You can also come over here and go to the Google Play Store and you can come over here and search and you can come down here and you can type in MX player and you can see right there it's going to say MX player. You can click that there and you'll see it's going to also be available right here. You have MX player uh, TV, MX player and MX player Pro. So you're going to be able to use that as well. So it's it's absolutely fantastic. It is my favorite player. I use this all the time. I install it on all my devices whenever I get a new device. It, it really, really is amazing. So there you have it. That's it right there. We will go over them again right quick. We have YouTube. That's my number one. Number two is Downloader. Number three is Aptoid TV. Number four is IP Vanish. And number five is MX Player Pro. All right, so there you have it. Those are five apps that I think you should install first on your NVIDIA Shield or on really any Android TV streaming device like your Fire Sticks, your Google Chromecast with Android TV, or your TiVo Stream 4Ks, your NVIDIA Shield Pros, your smart TVs with uh, with uh, with 
Android TV, pretty much anything that's Android TV based, those are the first five apps I recommend you install on your device. So anyways, I'll leave links to everything down below in the video description so that you can check them out. I'll also leave links to my Amazon page and my social media contacts. You can reach me elsewhere. And I hope you enjoyed seeing this video. If you did, please give it a big thumbs up and please subscribe to this channel and follow me on Instagram. And I am Larry with Today I Feel Like. Thanks for coming back to see me. Come back and see me soon. And until next time, love, peace, and hair grease. Peace.